Yes, welcome to Ten Central. Here we dig into entertainment, gossip, and political issues and bring you exactly what you might have missed. Now, just in case you want to give the moment of a scroll. Now, President Ruto has finally admitted that Morala Coco team, Mora, Morala Coco team points down. So, that conversation as to this road was promised, has not been built, that road is ongoing. But slowly, that road is going on well. That conversation about issues, development in our country is a very, very positive conversation. It is the conversation that I always wanted Kenya to have. <laughs> now, do you really think that the president is being genuine because he now give Zilla vibes a toxic boyfriend? Babe, I know many she can cheat, but I'm so proud right now that we can have this conversation. These are the kind of conversations that we should be having, positive conversations. And that means that our relationship is growing and it's working. Now, a bit of Romeo and Juliet. Did you know that if you date someone or get married to someone for too long, you either start looking alike or number two, you start behaving like them? You know, we talk, you know, we, in Kenya we have to plant with fertilizer. But Apostle Subi told me that Ugandans don't plant with fertilizer. This fertilizer that you hear our president saying, you know, we have to give the fertilizer to the farmers. In Uganda, there is no fertilizer, true? And uh, Apostle uh, Subi told me that he was so shocked when he came to Kenya and he found that Kenyans were planting their crops with fertilizer. But I got an answer the other day. The reason why Uganda is very fertile and it has been raining is because of the East Africa revival that swept Uganda. Sasa mutakuwa na international stadium hapa. Mechi ile inachezewa any part ile ya Arsenal ama Manchester United wanaweza kuja kucheza hapa. Anyway, that's that's my opinion though. <coughs> See what you think on the comment section. From Kenyan Jason Derulo to Diamond Platinums to Ruga. Yo yo what's up? This is a boy Kenya Ruga Auchi and I'm here Zuchu. We now have a new addition to the Kenyan list of celebrity lookalikes. These are Kadi B, um, Nicki Minaj, uh, Jesus Statham, Jason Statham, and um, finally Banner Boy. Now, that's not even my point. Now, from when the, the Gen Z girl, the Bradley Marongo, came into the limelight, he um, all of a sudden started getting relatives. Um, now, the first one was his brother from Bungoma, Isaac. And now, apparently, out of nowhere, out of the blues, Bradley's father has a TikTok account. And a Jita um, Baba Gen Z Goliath. And actually on that note, um, it happened that um, there was a comparison between the Gen Z Goliath, um, Bradley Marongo and uh, Isaac, the, the other one from Bongoma. And uh, surprisingly I saw that uh, ladies say um, that um, the original Gen Z Goliath is uh, cuter than the one from Bongoma. Um, upon the time I noticed all men are cute and handsome. Now it will only depend with who you're being compared with. In other news, um, in other some interesting, enticing, and um, spicy news. This video of Karen Nyamo has been trending for the better part of uh, this week, actually from uh, last weekend to this week. Now, I remember that time when we were, we were telling on her to the president, what are you going to say, Mati? She's arrogant um, and, um, and so much stuff, so much negative stuff. And uh, all of a sudden, we see her and nothing has happened. So, Anna danced to TikTok. But I came to ask myself, come and get president. Like, what I mean, like, clearly, you can see she has learned her lesson. Like, she's, you can, she's remorseful of her actions. Like, what I mean, I'm going to go to the house and I'm going to go to the house. 
by clearly surely she has learned her lesson now on our final story tonight do you really think it's a coincidence that um, at a time when um, the president ruto um, has managed to bug the western region kingpin then um, he happens to go on his tour um, to western and then he's presented with a very big fish as a present like he literally hooked the big fish literally hooked the big fish like it's all symbolic say what do you think anyway that's all for tonight um I'll see you on the next video make sure to like share subscribe and uh, press the notification bell so that every time we drop a video you'll be able to get a notification thank you for your time and see you next time